and a welcome to uh, another uh, unboxing, but this one's different. It is Classic Console, and inside is a mystery controller, and I don't know what's inside because you can't even feel it because it's hidden in like another shell of plastic. So let's see what we have. And even there, it's a mystery. <laughs> it's in a white box. So let's see what we got. Okay, so they want it to be a huge mystery because it's in wrapped in a white bag and we have, oh wow. It is a Game Boy Classic. In gold. Doesn't make any noise, but the buttons do push in. Um, kind of cheap plastic. And it looks nice. Um, but, man, it, it just feels cheap. I wonder if that glows in the dark. I've made Perler keychain Game Boys that glow in the dark. All right, so we got a Game Boy. And we got another mystery. And we got an SNES controller. Now, I was a big Nintendo fan. Let's get that out of the way. Nintendo fan back in the day. Um, I still am. Um, my NES and my Super NES are two of my favorite consoles. Um, I just simply love them. Um, like I say, once again, it's cheap plastic. The buttons, the shoulder buttons don't work, but the other buttons and the start and stop, I mean, start and start and select don't work, but the other buttons, they, they push in. <laughs> kind of cheap. But there we have it, a Game Boy and a Super NES controller. So, Oops, you can hear they sound cheap. Um, unlike, like my, I got a Godzilla. Uh, I'm a huge fan of Godzilla, so I got a Godzilla. Uh, I didn't unbox it but on camera, but, um, but this guy, he's solid. He's gonna take a beating, but that's Godzilla. Godzilla takes a beating. I think they could have done better on the plastics, uh, but other than that, I like them. So they will definitely be somewhere in my office hanging up. So. Thank you for watching. Please like, share, and subscribe. Be seeing you.